Hey guys, good morning. How are you all doing? I hope you all are fine and then staying at home safe, guys. I'm so grateful. I am super excited that I have some people out there who loves me. You guys are always checking on me. Yes, I'm fine. I am really sounding well. Yes, I am good. I'm fine now. You know, I need just a little bit of time for my voice to come back to normal. But now I am okay. I'm fine. Thank you so much to all of you. I love you guys. I love you guys. You guys are amazing. You guys are beautiful. Okay, guys, in today's video, it's going to be a random video, but it's going to be ultimate love and then big brother and I just some housemates or ex-housemates. Okay. I'm going to upload a video here where Kachi, um, Rose, Chris Ada, Chris Will, they had a live stream yesterday night. I have to grab some of the um, moment that will crack you up. I was just laughing like a mad person. These people, their friendship is real and they are really enjoying themselves. Kachi is down to earth and Chris Ville is a very playful someone. I really love this live stream. So I'm going to insert it here for you guys to watch it out and enjoy the moment. Okay. It doesn't have flaccid, you know, you're you just manufacturing your... This is B or TV well. Yeah. Two of us. True, true. Now, now, your man categorically stated on the street by using the emphatic word milk. Mm, but he said my milk. No, no. Okay, my milk. Yes. Now. That we feed you with my milk until you, you, you... Says no more. My brother, my brother, my brother. <laughs> So why are you holding your drink like that? Because I'm trying to bless you. <laughs> milk of life. The milk of, of life. My man, ah. I always work with you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> milk of life. Baby. Why, yeah, why did, why, baby. Did I, why did I get so excited please, talking about please, milk? Please, Egbo, please help me ask him. The milk that he tweeted on, What what is that milk? Okay, you need an extensive yeah, explanation. explanation. Yeah. Now, my brother. The word milk itself, it connotes and denotes so many things. Yeah, yeah, but so he, many said, he said, he said my milk. Eh, hey, hold on. See. Yeah, but Kachi, why would you hold tweet on, that? See, what was on your mind? I'm gonna insert another video about Icreza. This young, beautiful couple. I don't know what to say again. I know they are beautiful, they are unique, and there is a short clip I'm gonna insert here. Ike was saying that he was just being real in the house. He was not there because he wanted to be with somebody for selfish interest or when he needs something from that person, that's how he's going to be with that person. I said that everything he has done in the house is real because somebody who is going to be at your children is not something you will joke with. It's something that you should be serious with. Oh my world. I'm going to insert this so that you can hear it from the horse's mouth. And I'm also going to put some of their new, 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 new photo suits. Very beautiful ones. And then you guys will see it out. Be with somebody, you know, have children with this person, grow old with this person. And that is not something that should be joked with. So I can't be because, oh, I want to show that I'm a better, I'm better than you. Then let me now fake my relationship or fake this with this person so that I'll win or at the end of the day, get something out of it. It was legit. It was, yo, this is real life. You cannot joke with things like this. So for me, it was not a competition. It was just being the best version of myself ourselves and whatever position anyone has reached with more okay. you know in the outside world now so that's just what it is did you guys like agree on to you in the house Teresa? in the house yeah. um guys another gist out here i heard that guys is not from me i heard that bob risky is the cause of bolale and anor separation their separation is kind of mad because Bolale really loves Anor. But we all knew that Anor was trying to play the game when they were in the house. And even when they came outside the house, I was not really um, convinced with Anor's attitude. And then now finally they have fallen apart. 
People are saying that Anor is a sight. I don't know. I don't want to finish this sentence. Please let me know in the comment section if Anor is really Bob Risky's sight. Mm -hmm. Beautiful, but risky. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? These two shall be televised. Let's see. There is another video I'm gonna insert here. Uh huh. Um, it was just, I think, their one year anniversary, Mercy, and then one of the missionaries did a video for her talking about her journey. Her journey because she had been going for audition for five times, and then the fifth one that was when she was given the chance and later you got what happened she won so it was so emotional when i was listening to it so if you know that you want to go for big brother and Niger, let no one stop you go with your mind try 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 yes if you try try you make it happen guys in my own meaning of no is next opportunity so i want to tell you a story of how a young girl beat all odds and conquered the world. It was just yesterday, Messi A.K. Chimeyewa was seen on the streets of worry, queuing up to get that ultimate opportunity. An opportunity she was denied four times in the past. She didn't give up. She kept trying and pushing. And alas, she was picked to become a contestant of the Pepper Dem season. Finally, an opportunity to change her life. She was elated. She felt fulfilled. She couldn't wait for the experience. Immediately, she touched the stage, filled with audience from all over Nigeria. All I could hear was cheers from the crowd, from the host, from the housemates. Her daring outfits, her banging body. Last but not the least, came up, right? She did a TikTok miming talking about her accent. So, I'm gonna insert this. You guys will laugh, you will laugh. Different accent switching from one place to another. It's not her voice, but she just did the miming. Okay, guys, I think this is the end of the video. And if you love the video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you appreciate what I'm doing, please don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell. So, I'm giving shout out to everyone, every subscriber out there. Love you. Bye. So, a lot of you guys have been asking me, like, where I'm actually from because I have a lot of different accents and you guys are like girl just tell us where you're from and that's like why do you have so many different accents it's mad at this point truth be told like many immigrant kids I learned English watching TV so like I picked up on a lot of different accents and depending on the setting I'm in I, I could be southern in one moment and then switch it up and then boom I'm, I'm speaking in my African accent, apparently. This is how Africans talk. It's nonsense. <laughs> oh my god. It's who I am, oh. It's just stuck. Deal with it. I'm tired of people questioning me and telling me, ah, all of a sudden you speak British. Are you getting paid, isn't it? Are, you pay are, are they paying more? So, a lot of you guys have been asking me, like, where I'm actually from because I have a lot of different accents and you guys are like girl just tell us where you're from and that like why do you have so many different accents it's mad at this point truth be told like many immigrant kids I learned English watching TV so like I picked up on a lot of different accents and depending on the setting I'm in I, I could be southern in one moment and then switch it up and then boom I'm, I'm speaking in my African accent, apparently. This is how Africans talk. It's nonsense. <laughs> oh my god. It's who I am, oh. It's just stuck. Deal with it. I'm tired of people questioning me and telling me, ah, all of a sudden you speak British. Are you getting paid, isn't it? Are, you pay are, are they paying money?